Now to the start of tax season. The IRS accepting income tax returns as of tomorrow. And unlike the last two years, there'll be no COVID extension this time. ABC's Deirdre Bolton joins us with some crucial information as you get set to tackle those forms. Good morning to you, Deirdre. Good morning, Eva. There are a few things to know that are different this year rather than last year. You mentioned that timing factor, and that is true. There is no filing extension. April 18th, that's it. There are two other challenges for many Americans in filing correctly this year. Details from the expanded child tax credit and stimulus payments. All unemployment support is taxable in 2021. That's unlike 2020 where there was a special tax break on some of the money. For the child tax credit, experts say it is really important to take extra care to correctly report the money you received or else you risk lengthy delays when it comes to receiving your tax refund. So parents need to watch their mail for a letter from the IRS to reconcile what they received in advance to what they could still be owed when they file a return. One additional bright spot for families, a lot of lower income families who were not eligible for the child tax credit in other years were made fully eligible in 2021. Worth noting, there are free online resources if your adjusted gross income is $73,000 or less. There is free tax software available at irs.gov. There is the free file program. Eva? Deirdre, thank you. The bottom line, no matter if you're getting a refund or not, taxes are never fun. No, <laughs> no. no. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.